Hello, everyone. Uh, and I think uh, we've all seen the news about uh, change of uh, the Nera notes. And for me, honestly, I don't even know where I stand on it. My first thought was that Nera note at this moment, when we are thinking of focus on the election, is this what is should be the priority? As in, you know, you you all first of all have to, it's going to be expensive. You have to change to the changing, you know, all of, all of that thing. And Nigeria now, is that what our priority, is that what should be the priority of the CBN? And looking at the fact that Nera has been just going down like no man's business. It's just losing value. That's the, that, that's my first instinct. Then on the second th thought again, I'm thinking, hmm, what is the effect of this? You know, there are a lot of politicians who have looted Nigeria. Some of them have looted for decades. And they have stash and stash of money that they always bring out during election. And this money are just kept somewhere. They are not within the banking uh, system. They don't they don't go through the banking system. I remember in twenty was it twenty nineteen election? Yeah, there were there were reports that there were actually some money, a particular party, I'm not gonna mention the, the name of the party now. Uh, that they, they they came with their money that had the uh, what 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 do you call this thing uh, this paper that they use uh, the the wrap the, the the wrap of a bank that had been defunct for a long time that had closed off for a long time so that's to say this money had been collected for years and years ago they are just stashed somewhere and they have this uh, like vote where they, where you can just get their money and use and so my other this thing is thinking hmm now they, they say within 13 days you have to change the money so how are they going to bring those money in what account are they going to put, put them remember also there are also where uh, the the law where certain amounts entering an account they have to be flagged ESCC has to be on alert to check the different money and uh oh i have this thing it's in here and and then when if if they don't and if they don't change the money they won't be able to use the money again especially when we know with all of this issue of uh, vote buying and whatever they won't be able to use that money uh because it will it will not it will it will not no longer be a legal tender when they if they change uh the money except if if they say that you're going to be using both at the same time i don't, I don't think that's what the the cbn uh, uh governor is, is, is saying so that's that that's for me so i'm just like here yeah. and and also the other thing also is looking at the the stress on 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 a lot of people especially people who don't do banking people who are traders who keep because there's a lot of money in circulation in nigeria out of within the banking uh system I think the other day I was, I think when they were reading the report, there are more money outside the banking system than there are in the banking system. And I've, I can attest to that being a market woman because there are a lot of people who don't want to do banking. I remember, for example, in my, in my place, I think, I think about a decade or so ago, I decided that in my, uh, my, this thing, you just have to bring it uh do transfer it took such a long time there were even some customers that even stopped coming just because of that some of them were forced to keep still keep coming because there are certain products that i happen to be a sole distributor uh in that particular place so it was such a major major issue so there are a lot of people who they don't do banking so it's going to be very stressful for them and everything but at the same time again i'm looking at in terms of people who have stolen money for a very long time who have hidden this money who are continuously using this money especially during election time this might be uh, a game changer so for me honestly i don't know i wait to find out is this what should be done the stress on people or whatever and then i wait with the father some people with those money that they that are not that they've stolen and kept somewhere for over some of them have stolen this money for over 20 years 10 15 years and whatever that now they will now know that they, they, they either they can't use that money or they'll be forced to come out with that money and they will have efcc and everything on them if you notice already there are people who are fighting this this whole thing look at where the, the, it's coming out for so on this one honestly i don't know for me it's a double edged sword it's not really like a double edged should I call it double edge so or just I'm neither here nor there on it. So please, what's your own opinion? What do you think about it? Let me just uh let's interact in, in that uh comment section because it can be a good thing on one hand. You on the other hand, you say okay, it can stress some people. Uh, for example, people who don't have a bank account, where do, what do they do with their money and, and all of that? This kind of uh, of situation because there are people that it can really affect. At the same time, also there are people that have it will not be it will not make them 
uh, those things, those advantage that they have corruptly gotten, they will not be able to use it at the way it is. So that's it. But let me hear, uh, let me, let's, let me see your comments. Just drop them. What do you think about this? Thank you. Bye.